okay uh, now um, i think it is important that you must know uh, what will happen with the polyunsaturated fatty acid the polyunsaturated fatty acid those containing double bond at the multiple side and if that double bond is in the cis position definitely it will produce hindrance as i discussed in the monounsaturated and i gave you the example of palmito oleic acid which is containing one single double bond at delta 9 position so the cis configuration will always be changed by the isomerase in oil isomerase enzyme but keep remember whenever beta oxidation will take place whatever fatty acid component is involved that must be converted first into its aceta uh, its uh, coa derivative once it is converted into coa derivative then beta oxidation will take place now come to polyunsaturated fatty acid and if we will take example of linoleic acid which is containing 18 carbon and there are two double bond one is at the delta 9 another one is at delta 12 the uh, first step coa derivative of linoleic acid is synthesized and that <coughs> which is known as <coughs> lino linoleoil coa that linoleoil coa uh, now undergo into beta oxidation reaction and during this uh, beta oxidation reaction three molecule of acetyl coa are released and the linoleic coa will become shortened up to the chain 12 carbon fatty acyl coa having now the cis double bond at position number 6 and 3 uh, and 6 previously and now at sorry uh, previously it was having the position of double bond at carbon number 9 and 12 and after releasing of 3 acetyl coa the shifting of double bond position will be at carbon number 3 and 6 so it will become cis delta 3 and cis delta 6 Uh, 12 carbon fatty acyl coa this is the new component which is synthesized Uh, there is an enzyme uh, that is delta 3 delta 2 in oil coa isomerase what it will do it will convert cis delta 3 to trans delta 2 and 6 delta 6 will remain unchanged a new cycle of beta oxidation releases one more acetyl coa in the next step and 12 carbon fatty acyl coa is shortened to 10 carbon now it is having one Uh, cis double bond uh, at the position new position four and trans double bond at the new carbon two. The enzyme two four di in oil reductase add two hydrogen atom which are donated by NADPH two, so it will remove cis delta four. while the trans delta 2 become trans delta 3 the enzyme in oil coa isomerase now shift trans 3 to trans 2 now the remaining four cycle of beta oxidation will take place smoothly by the uh, shifting of these double bonds